So if you guys have any master battles in today, I've got another unboxing. The last one for a little bit. And probably what I think is a really cool bay. And that is Wild Wyvern. Um, this bay I thought for since I saw it, I was like, this bay looks cool. And I'm very happy to have this one. Fortunately, it came 7th slash 8th. Uh, depends. I opened the other one up first, but they came at the same time, technically. So, look here. I get another launcher. Yay. That's pretty useful, you know, having another one. Let's take out this sticker thingy. And it's gonna do that. Got all my stickers. Haven't used them. So, glad this is, you know, I finally get another bay that comes with, comes with the launcher. Because, as of right now, I have the sword launcher. From um, Xeno Excalibur, the um, regular launcher from Victory Valkyrie, and then the string launcher, Excalibur. Which means that's three, and only three. And it's, you know, nice having more, especially because I can actually launch with these. I like these more than Picard Tony's, you know, launchers from the Real Fight area. Because I couldn't launch those, they're too small. Unless that was a ploy to make you buy extensions and spend more money. I, I, I'm, I'm gonna doubt that, but <laughs> okay. So there's the driver and the launcher. Now let's get the layer out and look at this. Now this is cool. So another launcher. That's always good. Here we go. We have a wild wyvern, dark, awesome looking purple with clear plastic, obviously. Um, its teeth look kind of small. That makes me think it's kind of bad. Hope that's not the case, because this bay looks awesome. Awesome looking bay. Then, uh, then we've got vertical vertical um, orbit, right? Yes. Vertical. This thing looks awesome. Whoa. This is really cool looking. I like this. And then we've got orbit. Now orbit has a free spinning ball, which I think is awesome, although it seems to kind of get stuck sometimes depending on which way you do it, you know? But I don't think that's going to really affect it because I think it's kind of supposed to be like that. That's like if you move it, so like, you know how the little, like, can you see it? Little, like... That's how you can do it. Come on, come on, I, know you, I know you can do this. Focus really in before. Come on, you had it. If you can see, like, it's very hard because it's not a... It's not focused properly, but uh, there's a little line right in the middle of it. Just focus a little bit better. Focus on different things. Can you focus on my thumb? Well, there's a little line here. That's where the ball was like produced, you know, in two halves, and that gets stuck sometimes. It gets kind of stuck a little bit. But... Ooh, that that clicked in real way too easily. But, for all the wyvern. This stadium back. Let's put the camera down. And now let's give it a test launch. Wyvern looks really cool. <coughs> it makes me almost want to put stickers on it, but yellow and red don't look great with purple. Or at least I would just want to see this purple color because that's a cool purple. I like it. That is a terrible viewpoint. That's like slightly better. Not really because my thing's about to fall over. I don't think that's even touching the ground. Oh, it's barely touching the ground. Okay. You guys can kind of see it there. Well, that came apart really easily. 
So this is a wild wyvern. Um, vertical orbit, so I'll test around a little with it a little bit and uh, see how good it ends up doing. Um, I just got, I did a bit with Kerbius, um, and then I got two new bays. So by, by first looks, I'm going to tell you right now, um, I haven't really used, you know, Behemoth and Wyvern yet and Kirby's much, but I'm going to say probably early on. Oh, jeez. It did fall over. Not exactly sure how it fell over, just because our house is too clean. Okay. I need to turn you. I don't know. It's just one of the legs. Even when I turn. What if I turn it toward the leg? That's the leg. It's not going to fall forward. So I'm going to say early on, Wyvern, although I haven't used it yet. Then I want to say Xeno, Excalibur, and well, uh, Victor Valkyrie, and Kerbius. These are my favorite four. I think they look really cool by looks. And not they not that they perform well, but you don't have to like Bayes that perform well. Because I like Capricorn a lot. Capricorn sucked. Then I'm going to say Excalibur, because Excalibur is actually good and fun to use. Ragnarok, uh, after actually having him, he's not the greatest in the world. I thought he'd be a bit, you know, better more fun to use then um i haven't used him yet so i don't have an opinion unlike wild wyvern i don't think he's he looks really cool so yeah that's early on opinions kind of around this order but he's kind of a wild card he can kind of go anywhere really um same with him i guess he can move down a bit but i don't see him moving down too much because he just looks awesome and he's got such cool looking cards and stuff but yeah so hope you guys enjoyed um remember to like comment subscribe and share and hopefully I'll get some Babel Burst Battle Thoughts soon. Oh, and... There's gonna be snow, apparently. Friday is the forecast. Don't get snow much here, so... Maybe I'll do something special early in the morning, because I'm always up early. So, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later.